What's up guys, what's going on? So I picked up the Kith Tree Tweety today. Uh, it's below me. I'm gonna do just a little box thing and show it to you. So the hoodie came in a large like Kith Treats box. Uh, basically it looks like a cereal box. It has some Kith Treats branding on the front, on which are like milkshakes, cereal bowls, uh, hoodie sized box, what are we, 500 GSM. So it's a very heavy sweater, 100% cotton, oh, free pencil in, oh wow, free pencil. I haven't opened it yet. <laughs> uh, on the back, there's like, like an old school cereal box would have if you guys are a little bit older a game on the back of the box so that you can like fill in the hoodie with a pencil that's not going to happen here especially since they gave you the free pencil so it kind of makes more sense now uh bottom you can see all the colors that it did come in the blue the yellow the pink the orange the mint uh, light green as they describe it light purple so it's all lights on the colors except for the pink the pink is just pink and the other colors are light blue light yellow light orange light green light purple uh tag on the bottom is a size large they did look like they ran pretty big i put a medium up against my body and i was like wow this is pretty full so i just went with a large um let's get into it oh it really is like a cereal box let me let me get some more details on this so like the side of the box has a whole bunch of like cereal nutrition facts but it's actually not cereal it's uh the specs on the actual hoodie. So size specs, extra small. It tells you like the chest width, arm length, all that stuff. And then all the way down to double XL. I'm not gonna go over all that. You don't need to know. You open the box like you would a cereal box, which is kind of dope on the top. Has a little pull tab that you reinsert to keep it fresh. And then inside, which I've always been a fan of is the packaging. I like the bags. I prefer the way they do this. It's it's different from a lot of other brands. Not a lot of other brands, but I, I just feel like it's classic to their style. Um, they used to always do bags and I preferred it. Came in like the plastic cheap ones at first, but like always like a dope effect saying Kith on it. So this is the large hoodie. It kind of fits like a uh, extra large hoodie in some of the other fits or like the original Williams hoodie. Uh, definitely fuller on it, so size down if you're trying to acquire it or for future reference as far as the hoodie goes. I wish I could get this apparel beforehand so I could shoot these reviews so you guys know if you're trying online because most people probably just go for their typical size and uh, they're not really particular about letting people know details on things I find from time to time. Like even the raffle from the other day, they didn't really post anything to let people know they were doing a raffle even though a lot of people entered or everyone entered and they got their spots filled. Um, I, I feel like the communication could be a little bit better and I know the new store is opening. I shot a vlog today, didn't really shoot a vlog today. I shot like maybe six minutes of stuff and I had to give up because I had stuff to do. So uh, it's, it's like hard to do both. But anyway, um, with the new store opening for Kith, with the closing of the old store, with the pop-up for the Pippin stuff, it, it was just a lot. Plus the treat stuff coming up, like somebody came up to me asking about these hoodies at the Pippin release, which was yesterday, Friday. Um, and I was like, that's Monday hoodies, aren't they? I, I had no idea what was going on. Like, it, it, it's just been a little bit of a calamity, if you will. But anyway, the sizing on the hoodie is pretty good. Uh, the size large fits, like I said, an extra large. So if you're trying to get it, like I said, size down, uh, room in the arms, room in the chest. I have a t-shirt on underneath this and it's like, a, it's not a thin t-shirt, but it's not a heavy t-shirt either. So uh, typical hoodie style, you can pull it down and let it drape. If you guys can see it, or you could let it, like I like to pick it up and just let it drop and then fix it up myself so it doesn't look too crazy. Form fitting, uh, color's great, and the box on the logo or around the kit is the velvet. So if you guys picked up anything from Love Thy City, um, the black or whatever the logo t-shirts were, they had this uh, felt, felt or like velvet feel to it. That's what this is. I wasn't going to pick it up until I saw that it was uh, like a velvet feel to the box logo because I, I don't really need to know the screen print on my hoodie. Uh, it adds a different flair to it, gives a different effect. I like the way it feels, I like the way it looks. And uh, you have a little tree tit underneath the Kith logo to be proportionate with the box logo for Kith. Um, overall, very pleased with this. Let's do the t-shirt real quick. So this is slightly annoying. Uh, the t-shirt did come in a box as well. I, I just happened to grab uh, a loose one just because I didn't feel like having two boxes in my bag. Should have did that for the review, but it is what it is. It's basically the same thing, just a smaller box for a t-shirt. This is also a size large. Uh, it's a little bit longer than the hoodie on the straight down and a little bit more tapered on the body. So I could have did an XL, probably would have felt a little bit more comfortable in it. So diet time. Anyway, uh, colors dope, this is the light purple. Uh, these are my two favorite colors. I, I didn't want to do a light purple hoodie. So I went with the t-shirt cause I was, I like those pastels. So the mint was definitely for me. Um, other than that, like I said, I, I definitely could have sized up a little bit. You can see inside here, I got a little bit of pull. It's not loose, so extra large would have been good. So true to size uh, on the t-shirt, size down on the hoodie. Hope you guys like the review. Uh, I'm gonna also review the apparel or some of the apparel that I picked up for the second Pippin release. 
Uh, oh yeah, no, yeah, the second part of the Pippin release were just the Pippins. Uh, I got a couple of hoodies and a couple t-shirts and I did get a pair of track pants. So if you guys want to catch that, it'll be in a different video. If you're not subscribed, you hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or comments, hit me in the comment section and uh, peace.